What's going on, YouTube? We're back. Episode 37 of this Genshin Impact playthrough. We just finished up defeating the Fatui here, and we learned that we need to make our way to Gentry Macau's residence to talk to him. Obviously, we're still with Zheng here. He's still reading this book. So I think we're going to have to part ways and make our way back to Liwei Harbor. Let's go. So, our destination here is right there. So, let's go. Teleport time. All right, Gentry, where is your house? I think it's up. So, Let's continue on. No time to lose. This is a peaceful neighborhood. Okay, there's this place. I wonder what he's going to tell us. Dirty Woo. Who goes there? I'm a monster merchant? Really? He didn't mention anything about a meeting. The master's dealing with some urgent business today. All prior appointments have been canceled. Urgent business? What is it? <sighs> the master's been working on a major business deal recently. He left early this morning to meet with a VIP client. So, where is he now? I'm sorry. The master is stressed that we must not disclose that information to just anyone. Just anyone? Are you saying we're not his VIP clients? Uh, no, I, I I mean, yes. Yes, you are. <laughs> I, I, I meant no offense. P please, believe me. Take me to Gentry or suffer the consequences. I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Master's currently in business negotiations at Shinya Kiosk. I, I beg for your mercy, please. My master will show me no leniency if he finds out. <laughs> Well, my master has much more important things to do than talking to rude guards like you. Luckily for you, your bad attitude will be the last thing on his mind when he's busy negotiating a big business deal with your boss. Thank you, thank you. May your business forever be blessed by the Lord of Geo. Didn't the Lord of Geo just die? Nice work! Paimon never knew you were such a tough negotiator. You did great, too. <laughs> Paimon loves compliments and all, but treating Paimon to some tasty snacks would show that you really mean it. Of course. Anyway, seems like the VIP client in question must be one of the Fatui. I think you're right. In that case, let's get ourselves over to the Shinue Kiosk. Seems business is booming at the Shinua kiosk. No one should notice if we blend in there. But either way, if we want to know what kind of shady business they're up to, we better be careful. All right, where is this kiosk located? Looks like... around here somewhere up okay so it's kind of right above us and with that the fate of the we don't want to climb child was wow. you do tell the cleverest jokes where is it we're like pretty close I have to assume I understand I do Please, do not worry. You have my word that the order will be completed as promised. Hmm. The subordinate I sent was not quite so optimistic in his appraisal. Is somebody being uncooperative? Uh, we just ran into a minor procurement problem, is all. We haven't managed to purchase the Core Lapis yet. But it's nothing for you to worry about. If Chang the Ninth won't sell, I can buy from someone else. 
That would be most ideal. I remind you again that the Fatui care only about the result. We are willing to lend a certain degree of support to this transaction. But if it is not completed in time, you may suddenly find our goodwill comes at a price you cannot afford. I understand. I am indebted to you for your protection. You know I would not dream of disappointing you, don't you? We shall see when the time comes. <laughs> Darn that old man, Chang. So, Mr. Gentry Mozai is colluding with the Fatui. Sure seems like it. Who knows if Gula Geek has made any progress? Should we go tell him? All right, so we have to go meet back up with Jing. I assume... Oh, he made it back to Li Wei as well. So... Right. No time to lose. Jump out here and glide on over to him. I think he is also up there by Gentry's place. So we we'll back up these stairs. And where is Jing? Ah, oh, there no he is. No time to lose. Yeah. Hiding in the corner. You had other things to look into, as if you're some sort of man of mystery. When actually, all you meant was you wanted somewhere new to park your backside while you read your book. We know what Gentry is up to now. I see. I guessed as much. Did you really guess, or are you just saying that to sound clever? The course of action we must take is now clear. To start with. Please deliver this letter to the Feiyun Commerce Guild. They will know what to do. My liege, for reasons that I cannot explain, I will be unable to join you. What? There is no need for you to read the contents of the letter. When the time comes... Ugh, this writing is super hard to read. Python can't make heads or tails of it. It's in an ancient script, perhaps? Uh, hence why I said there is no need for you to read it. The Feiyun Commerce Guild will have someone who can understand it. But well, why would you want to get them involved? They're one of the big wig commerce guilds in Liyue. Why would they want to help us? What is the Feiyun Commerce Guild? Since we got to Liyue, Paimon keeps hearing people mention it. Seems they oversee a lot of business that goes on around here. Having such big backing would be great and all, but are you sure they'd want to help? No need to worry about that. From what I know, they share my sense of chivalry. Once they have read the carefully reasoned and passionately argued case I put forth in this letter, they will certainly be moved to action. Why get them involved, though? Gentry Mautzai must be taught a lesson he will never forget. This is something we cannot do on our own. Also, I do not wish for anyone else to know of my involvement in this. Why not? You're only doing this to try and help Ching the Ninth, right? To silently disappear at the matter's conclusion, concealing one's name and contribution. This is the chivalrous thing to do. To savor the memory is ample reward. Each droplet of kindness I receive, I am duty-bound to repay with a welling spring of gratitude. I seek neither praise nor reward. I guess that's admirable. That sounds very lovely. But be honest, you just want them to do it so you can carry on reading your book, don't you? Facts. Thank you in advance for delivering this letter to the Feiyun Commerce Guild. Someone from the guild should be able to receive you near Lioli Pavilion. Hey! Stop ignoring Paimon! Alright, so we got his letter and we need to deliver it to the Commerce Guild. Where is this pavilion, though? Is he 
seems to be this way, so we can just glide on over. Ah. Alright. That was easy. Excuse us. We come bearing news of a matter requiring your assistance. Uh, it's all in this letter. A letter? Oh, I see. This again. Again? Oh, don't mind me. I was just speculating. Let me give this a read. Can we actually read this thing? Is it even written in the common tongue? Hmm. Yes, the script is inimitable by the uninitiated. Honored guests, you must both be wary from your long journey. Please allow the Feiyun Commerce Guild to be your host for tonight. Wait, what? Please rest assured that the matter written about has been duly received. We just need some time to prepare. Please take a seat here in Leo Lee Pavilion, where you may enjoy some light refreshments while taking in the ocean view. Consider it a small token of our esteem. Yay! Tasty snacks! They're giving us the VIP treatment! Of course, Paimon would be excited about treats. Of course. We treat visitors with the utmost respect here at the Feiyun Commerce Guild. When honored guests grace us with their presence, far be it from us to shirk our duty to them. Please, this way. And Paimon thought we'd get kicked out, or turned away at the door. Paimon didn't think Guhua Geek had so much clout. Thank you for your patience. With the amount of wealth and power Gentry Mount Tsai has, it will take more than a slap on the wrist to get through to him. For him to correct the error of his ways, he must feel for himself the same suffering he has inflicted on Chang the Ninth. Since Gentry Mount Tsai's business has to do with Core Lapis, we simply need to buy up all the stock there is in Liu. That will put him in a rather sticky situation. Deprived of the necessary raw materials, even the best craftsperson in Tevat would be unable to make their product. Great idea! That'll be sure to mess things up between him and the Fatui. Where do we get all this money? But Liu is huge! Is it really possible to buy up every last bit of Core Lapis in the harbor? With the time scale we are on, it is indeed a challenge. Hence, as stated in the letter, we must ask for your further cooperation in the matter. First, there are a number of vendors in the city you will need to buy from. I've marked their respective locations on your map. There is also some unsold core lapis at the chasm. You will need to purchase that too. Finally, there is Chang the Ninth's batch. Alrighty, so three sellers in the city, another one at the chasm, and then Chang the Ninth. Roger that! Of course, we are not expecting you to cover the costs. Oh, good. Wow! So many Mora! With cash like this, Paimon could rent out Leoli Pavilion and eat there for a whole month! They're definitely generous. <laughs> well, this is not the first time we've had to do something like this. It's just par for the course now. All you need to do is strike a deal. The Feiyun Commerce Guild will handle the transportation and other trifling matters. Once you have purchased all the Core Lapis, Please proceed to the Feiyun Commerce Guild's warehouse, where you can see the rest of the plan unfold. Gotta hand it to Guhua Geek. This is some seriously solid work for a guy who lives in a fantasy world. Let's do this in the order the guy said. First the sellers in the city, then the chasm, and then last but not least, Chang the Knight. Enjoy ninth. your meal. So, we have to go purchase... Or lapis from different vendors. Starting with this guy. Good day, my friend. Uh, my apologies, but I'm out of stock at the moment. Please try. Are you out of core lapis too? Oh, I thought you were here to purchase Snezhnaya products. No, that I still have. Although I ship it all to factories in Snezhnaya. I don't do retail. Too much hassle, not enough return. Sorry. Does we'll take it all still count? What? Uh, no, 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 no. Give me a second to think. Um, uh, all right, I'll do it. Just need you to sign for it. Clearly no shortage of cash flow in the air. Nice. I think the nice. next spot is actually underneath us. Yep. Talking to this guy. Can't Hola. Be the atmosphere Oi! Shh, keep your voice down. 
I'll take all your core lapis. All of it? Though my business may not seem so big, I should warn you that I can get what you need, both legitimately and not so legitimately. <laughs> Best you give me an actual number. All of it would be far more than you actually want. It's for the Feyun Commerce Guild. Fe Feyun Commerce Guild? Well, why didn't you say so? If it's for the Feyun Commerce Guild, then sign on the dotted line, and I'll start getting things in order right away. Nice. So there's one last place it looks like that we need to go get Core Lapis from. Seems to be this door. No time to lose. How do we get back up? We probably need to run back up these stairs here. It seems to be. Over here to the left? Yeah, right here. The key here is consumer psychology. Hi, anything I can do for you? I'll take all your core lapis. We're buying it all. Y you want all my core lapis? Uh, I've already agreed to several orders. That said, none are in writing. The buyers are being incredibly indecisive. Oh, it's for the Feiyun Commerce Guild? Hmm, seems business trends are about to change in Liyue. Yep. Oh, uh, <laughs> nothing. Just talking to myself. Come, let us sign a contract. Don't worry about my prior client. He hadn't made any down payments or anything. Quite common in the industry. Thank you for your patronage. We hope the Feiyun Commerce Guild will continue to do business with us. <laughs> this is going well. Everything's so much easier when you've got stacks of Mora. Next stop, the chasm. So, we're, we've been instructed to go around and purchase all the core lapis so that Thank somebody you. else can't so purchase much, it. Lady. That seems a little here. shady, but we'll have to see where this takes us. Our next destination is go to the chasm and buy core lapis. That's where we'll head off to next episode. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.